Leroy Nicky Barnes, who for seven years in the 1970s was godfather of the largest and most profitable heroin selling operation in the history of New York City. Between 1973 and 77, Barnes was arrested variously for homicide, bribery, drug dealing, and gun possession, but none of the charges stuck. He became a Harlem legend and very rich, and whatever he had, he flaunted, be it women or Rolls Royces. But in 1977, Barnes, who had been arrested 13 times on various charges but never convicted, was indicted once again. What was his reaction to this latest indictment? He posed for the cover of the New York Times Sunday magazine. They called him Mr. Untouchable.